How do you rate the chances of progress now that they're back? I, 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 think, I think they're good. Um, I've had the privilege to serve in government since uh, 2011 now, so I've been present when the institutions were working well together, when we had regular NS NMSSC meetings, regularly uh, engaging with the, with the north-south bodies and uh, going to Armagh for sector meetings, and I've also been there for two suspensions. Um, and when they happen, they tend to go on for years. So uh, I think it's something we always need to bear in mind that if, if, things, if things don't succeed, you can't assume they'll be back up and running six months later. It's more likely to be two to three years later. But certainly meeting with the new uh, First Minister, Deputy First Minister, the new executive members, I think there's a lot of good faith there. I think they want to make it work. Um, we need to help them do that uh, as best we can, um, not by interfering, but by assisting. Um, and you know, there are electoral cycles and, you know, there's going to be elections obviously here in this jurisdiction, there's going to be elections to the House of Commons. I think it'd be really great if the executive could run through those political events, um, working together, cooperating, and I think that's achievable. That will require business to be done in Stormont, perhaps in different ways to the way in which it happened previously. Are there lessons that people need to learn, do you think? I, 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 I suppose I think lessons have been learned and, you know, there are new sustainability protocols brought in. Um, but, you know, I, I, I just, I just, I just, maybe, maybe I'm, I'm an optimist, but um, I just have the sense that, that there is a real genuine effort there and there is going to be a genuine effort there on behalf of uh, those sitting around the table in Stormont to try and make this work and to focus on a lot of the very practical problems that people, people in the North are facing.